someone set up camp in a tree. There's a serenity about this spot. Feels like something's about to happen today. That old home might not be stripped clean yet. What a find! and the pegs in sync. You really put a spin on it. Just put one foot in front of the other. Easy. You run like the wind. Fine time to be outside.
had no book it on. What a scrub dub So clean. You do it had no book it on. Welcomes you back. No need to brush this time. You do it had no book it on. Didn't have much else to say, so no problem. Vump is the place to be, obviously. Let's see. Good ride long. Tell it, no biting. on energy. Ah, see that in waste? Always handy. Crossway. This means you have a choice to make. Which way? Scrap's great for building things. story will go on as long as there is someone there to listen.
This won't be a field trip. It's the real thing. Wheel the control box handles to buzz the wire. Wired up and ready to go. Life is a difficult game, no matter how you play it. Want to get your arms swole? Grab those guns flexors and get pumping that iron. Got to time it right to make them work. Left, right, left, right. Pumping good, looking better. Couldn't just be open, eh? You need to flick the switches in order to process power through the panel. Good. The loop is electrified enough to spark. That's a motored blind box dispenser. These auto markets were quite popular in the long gone for those who had coin left for fun. Feel the night wrap around you.
that's the output you. Says you'll get a special price and a wrap. Points out they just. Some solid wood scrap there. Mountains are so ginormous. Ah, the Gnote Pen. Nocco never leaves this place. She's always put the living things first. Let's see. and the open goo before you. share the same destiny, destruction or survival.
fácil na tu. Nux isn't an easy language, but at least it's manageable. She says she is so happy to see you again. She wonders if you remember her. She's Noko. She let you ride her majut when you were a kid. Noko remembers you used to chase around with so much energy and is glad to see you haven't lost any of that spark. But that's all long gone now, though. Memories show us where we've been, not where we're going. Seems reluctant to even say its name. It's become personal to her too since it's taken so many of her innocent gnotes as prey. Noko remembers those days too, but she never lets herself wallow in them, no matter how tempting that can be. She sees your back to buck with Lupa Lupin. Can't see how there's any way to avoid that now. Not for long, at least. She says the horrors of your younger days were enough to ruin anyone, but not you. You've got all that cheer about you still. Andro? Noko says history is like the trail you've been on. You can walk back down it any time you like, until it's worn smooth. But you get to blaze your own trail from here. Then you are stronger than her. She can't help wanting Lupa Lupin to pay for what he did to her Gnotes, despite the fact it's against her nature. Asks how many paths you've wandered in the world, and if you ever wonder about what might have changed if you'd taken different ones. You can't do everything you want, can't go everywhere, can't see everything, only what you can. So happy the world is going to live, would have been crushed to see all the Gnotes die with it. Likes that you stood up for the world and spurred your way toward helping it out. Glad you saw the light with the myriad. They always bring a sparkliness to any day, and sometimes the nights do. Says that's only for a little while, and when your eyes clear, you see everything even better than before. But let's not speak of that now. She has an idea where the Majut might have gone, as there's no other place it likes as much as its own corner of the open wild. She's even named it the Majut Meadow. The Majut will recognize the scent you've attracted while being here, so it'll probably trust you enough to follow you. You should lead the Majut back here when you find it. It's going to take time to get it calm enough to be able to ride out to the World Eater. It's the most magnificent creature she's ever encountered. A creature straight out of a dream or story. Get under that sky while you still can.
There are places up ahead far worse than this. You found the Majut Meadow. Watch out for the Majut. Got it. Some barked wood scrap for you. Morning, Bassa. Now that the Majut is back in the pen, it seems calm, but Noko is still concerned. She says the Majut is still anxious, but fortunately she knows just the thing it needs to calm down. The Majut once found and ate a bonbon gummy by mistake, and that the chewing really calmed it down. She says that you should find some bonbon gummies for the Majut by the crossway. At least, that's where she found some last time. She figures the choosies from the old world are made from gummy trees, but wouldn't be surprised if they were actually made from some chemical concoction, though. Look at those notices on the board. Too bad the gnotes couldn't read them. If you wander around here, you might find Noko. She just loves those gnotes. Once the power ran out, it made sense to ride gnotes. And that tradition... Powered types of transportation polluted the world, but didn't poop in the street. Obviously, they didn't have their priorities right in those days. Watch your step here, and you might find tracks of another traveler. under all the muck in the gnote pen. Hard to believe the gnotes didn't trample it. They seem faster than you, and don't forget that when you ride them, they do all the work to keep you moving. You should keep moving. Can't let those gnotes blaze the trails for you. Just hold on tight.
Cranks like these usually need to be wound to operate the dispenser. What you see is what you get, once it's out of the blind box, that is. History is nothing but a series of stories. With its attention diverted to the chewy bonbon gummy, the Majut calms down. But Noko is still concerned. Bala. She's relieved the Majut has calmed down, but you'll need a heavier sit-tite to ride it than the one she's got. Karnamunta. The only sit-tite she can think of that would be heavy enough is one she's spotted mounted on an old world mecha Majut. If she remembers correctly, she spotted it at the Smilo Shopperia while scavenging for treats for the Gnotes. That's not so far away. It? It's a seat you fasten on the back of a mount to safen up your ride. It can become quite bumpy and risky without. Rain is clean now, but wait till it gets to the goo. The Smilo shopper here. Yes, shopping here put a smile on your face. What a blow! Shop, make that one dead. Locked up tight. The antenna needs to be pointed in the right direction. As the eye box broadcasts, it's hit or miss, but when it does hit, it's usually right in the fields.
You need to line up the switches so they match. Good. That's enough electric current to initiate the actuators. Activate the framework. Now hold on, sit tight. Isn't that the mechamajut over there? You need to loosen the bolts without rattling the mechamajut. That's it. The sit tight is loose. Time to stop horsing around and get the sit tight back to Noko. Give your mount a pat and pick a button. 